Hi, Happy New Year. This is Nala from Ghost Ship Floating. Uh, and I'm here to do the Seven Decks for Seven Deadly Sins VR Tag to Sylvain. Uh, hopefully I have some decks here that you haven't seen before in the other wonderful tag videos that I've been binging. Uh, sorry it's been so long, uh, but here we go. So the first one is Pride, a deck that you purchased or use for flexing. And I don't really do that, uh, but I am very proud of the tarot deck that I made that comes in this tin. It's the Mishmash Tarot. I have plenty left, both in person, uh, that uh, you can get from Etsy, or uh, it's on Make Playing Cards. All the information is in the description box. Uh, so here are the backs. I have a full flip through, but... Anyway, so that's that one. A lot of ear noise in the back. Sorry, I love other people. Uh, the second is Greed, a deck that you don't share with anyone or only use on yourself. Uh, for me, that is the Scary Stories Tarot. Um, it's just a little darker of a theme than, uh, you know, the rest of my family likes. Uh, they usually go for bright, cheerful, nature-filled decks, and this is a bit on the darker side. It's great for Halloween. I use it a lot then. All the drawings just, they're so expressive. Okay. And then we've got... Wrath, a deck that you're angry at, and I really, really hated to put this one in there. It's the Badger Forest Tarot. I love it to bits. It's such a cute, well-drawn tarot deck. Wonderful cardstock. I just, I love using it so much. Um, but the Minor Arcana don't have clear indications of what cards equal which suit, um, and doesn't come with a guidebook, so in order to tell, uh, which is which, you have to go look it up on the website, which is just a little bit of a pain in the neck, um, you know, when you want to do a the reading. Uh, it's, you know, it's nice when it's real clear, which is pentacles, swords, etc. Especially in a nature deck. Um, I mean, animals, they're all very earth-like to me. Uh, so, that's a little hard to tell. But other than that, I love it so much. Um, let me see. Envy, a deck that you purchased because other people have it. That would be the Raven's Prophecy Tarot. It's actually the first deck that I ever bought for myself. I love Maggie Steamwater as an author. Her artwork is so gorgeous. I just, I had to have this deck. Look at that color. Sorry, I'm very itchy today. Um, then there's Lust, a deck that you like for aesthetic reasons. And I just got this. It's the David's Tarot. Here are the backs. It's just such a gorgeous peaceful tarot deck 
something about the black and white aesthetic. It's just really, it screams winter to me. So it's a very great calming seasonal deck. Uh, there and there's gluttony, a deck that you really didn't need but purchased anyway. That would be my spirit cats. Uh, this is my only oracle deck. Uh, for this video anyway. I have others. Um, but I had a few cat themed decks already. Um, I love cats. And even though I had other ones, I just I couldn't pass it up. They're so cute. Look at those little fluffy cats. I love fluffy little cats. And finally, Sloth, a deck that you use when you feel lazy. Now, I couldn't let it go with just having one deck by Nikisha when the first one was the one that I was angry at. So I picked the Riderless Tarot. The backs are so cute. It's another pocket sized deck, which is perfect for me and my tiny lands. But not only are the colors beautiful, and the horses are so well done, but I mean, ju even just by the expressions, you can tell what's going on in each card. And the, uh, you know, just all the imagery, it just makes it so easy. And you're just a little tired or a little lazy and you just want to do a quick read or you know thumb through in bed or wherever you like to hang out it's just just a beautiful deck so those are my picks for the seven decks for Sedley. Uh, seven Ducks for Deadly Sins tag. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope you found some decks to buy for the new year. Alright, have a wonderful day. Bye.